The Sim Realist has made a brand new mod called Private Practice. It's been in the works for so long, and when they actually dropped the link last night in Discord, I was like, give it to me now. Let me download it, play with it, test it out, and see how it works in a nutshell. And I kid you not, it is freaking cool. It's phenomenal because it changes the way the Sims 4 health system works right now, and it's freaking cool. And the stuff that they're playing right now with this mod, like they're gonna add later, is amazing. So overall, I will leave the link down below in the description at the very top. If you do not download mods yourself, I actually highly recommend this one mod for your Sims 4 game. The goal of this mod pack is to rework the health system of the Sims 4, exploring the ability to take care of your sims health all under one of the same roof if you wish. The subjects of the sims health we wish to cover are general medical, plastic surgery, diseases, pharmacal stuff, optometry, dentistry, insurance, employee benefits, and more. And the fact that they are to, they're gonna add like plastic surgery in the game is kind of cool because you know you can go into creative sim and change the way your sim looks but I want to have plastic surgery just to add realism to the game, you know? And the fact that this mod is the very first version of this mod that they released to the public is speaking like, what? What in the frick? How did you do it? Like, teach me your ways. But overall, I freaking love it. So this mod, well, this version is the very first mod to, re to be released to the public. It's more of the base of the mod that will later be expanded upon with the areas that previously planned. We will gradually bring more points to the health data to be checked that could result into current in-game or custom illnesses, which will, which each what was each new area explored. Uh, health checkup. Now your Sims will want to look after their health. Great, finally, it's about time. When your sim goes to a health checkup appointment, you might learn about, about problems with their fitness or blood pressure. You'll be told what lifestyle changes your sim could make to improve them and what fact what factors, yeah, what factors will be making are making them to, at more at risk. Following following the doctor's advice might be something you want to do because if left unchecked, these health issues could be led to earlier natural death. And that right there is real because if you don't take care of your health, you might die early and you don't want that. So, you know, exercise, eat healthy, exercise, you know, take care of your health. It's kind of, you know, it's a real thing. And so I like that. Details on health issues, blood pressure, a new health data point that is being tracked with this mod. It can, it can be affected by the Sims age traits, fitness, and can fluctuate with their mood, energy levels, and hydration. Okay, so drink water, my kids. Drink water. Healthy for you. It's great. Wait, also a new health data feature that tracks the, uh, the fitness and fat of your sims of your sim. Being overweight or underweight will make your sims get tired a little faster or need a little more sleep to be rested. Me being underweight speaks the truth because I'm underweight and I don't get a lot of sleep and I get tired easily. So, yeah, that speaks the truth right then and there. <laughs> Just saying. Being overweight or underweight or having higher or low bl blood pressure can result in higher risk of further problems in, uh, with your sim's health. Their lifespan will subtly reduce every moment they spend with these health issues. So, yeah, I, I can see that happening to um, my sims right now because my sims don't eat healthy and I feel like they're stressed all the time and it, it, it again, it speaks the truth. On the other hand, good fitness, well, good fitness can expand your sims lifespan and I like that because I want my sims to live forever and I don't have time for death because I will cry every single time my sim dies. Either way, details on health checkups. The only way you can tell, the only way you can, the only way to tell if your sims, your, if your sim has any health issues is to attend a health checkup. A health checkup costs about 150 simoleons and lasts about one to two hours. And at the end, your sim will be given a health report. If your sim should go when they should be at work, the system will put them on a sort of sick leave until they come back home. To go for a health checkup, use the sim's phone, open up travel category and choose private practice. From private practice menu, you can view the health report from from your sim's last health report checkup. A health report displays the sim's fitness and blood pressure status. At the time of the checkup, click on or hover over the cursor over each of the results to read more information on what causes might contributing to the issue and what your sim can do to improve it. Okay, so either way, I think that is pretty cool because overall it doesn't cost that much because 
150, 150 Simones is not that much in The Sims. You can make that right then and there by selling a painting or whatever. But still, the fact that this mod is a real thing right now is speaking the truth. Like, I want to give credit to all these people. Like, everyone who made this mod possible, bless you, my children. Bless you. Marry me. Um, anyway, so both... <laughs> Basically, I freaking love this mod. It's freaking cool. So anyway, I am gonna go ahead and actually hop into the game and test out to to see what it looks like in a nutshell because I just I love it. I love it so much. But overall, I'm gonna go ahead and hop into the game and I will see you guys all in a second. Alrighty, guys. So here into the game. I'm actually in my second current household family, the Baroque family from The Sims 2. But this house and this family was created by my friend Jen X Urban Sims X on YouTube. But I did give them a little bit of a makeover. But if you guys want to check out the original video of the creative sim and the speed build, I will link down below in the description to our channel. But this is a private practice mod overview video. So overall, I'm going to be using Brandy Broke, who is the epitome of brokenness of life, as the example of this mod. So the way you can do this is by going to the phone, going to the travel category, and clicking private practice. And now we can choose from a health report or attend a health checkup. And since we have not gone to one, we are going to attend one for our very, very first one to see how badly or how good our health may be. Because honestly... We don't know. So right here is Bo Broke and we got Dustin Broke and we ha and Brandy just had a new baby boy called Theo Broke who is sleeping right now peacefully and I'm happy. But since the checkup is about 150 simoleons, we do have to work through um, our work just to gain that simoleon back because we are broke, living the broke lifestyle. And so Dustin, we're gonna have you wake up right now since the mother is out and about doing her stuff, getting that stuff ready to go. But we're gonna go ahead and give him a little bubble bath for Bo here because he's very smelly and very angry about the new sibling. But regardless, Bo is a gem. He's a graceful gem that he is. Uh, but Brenda should be back home any minute now from her health checkup, but she is back now. And so it says health checkup completed. Brandy has completed her their health checkup and has an updated health report. Brandy broke a healthy healthy weight and normal blood pressure. To view, we're going to view right here. Okay, cool. So a healthy weight. At their at their last checkup, Brandy was measured for a healthy weight. With with a little more work, Brandy could gain increased fitness and benefit from an expanded lifespan. If Brandy wants to improve their health further, it's recommended they use a workout machine or a punji bag to build up muscle. And also jog or use a treadmill to reduce body fat. Okay, we'll definitely do that for sure, Dr. Stanley. Uh, for normal blood pressure, so at the last checkup, she was measured for normal blood pressure. Due to their personality and, or physical traits, Brandy is expected for a high risk of problems with blood pressure. What are you talking about? I have normal blood pressure crazy doctor you don't know nothing <laughs> but anyway so that's pretty pretty cool it just says the same thing pretty pretty nice and so that's pretty much what the mod is in a nutshell you can basically do all that if you want to but i'm actually going to probably have i'm gonna buy a little treadmill just to increase the fitness so we can go back and and get another health checkup to see how we are improving our little our little um you know health to see because you know we want to improve our house, not ruin it, because that's what we need to do. So let's go and get a treadmill. There we go. And we're going to go ahead and work out for a little bit to reduce our little body fat there. Because Brandy is fit to AF and she is a graceful, graceful gem. Talk to self because she's insane. Um, but yeah, I, I honestly think that is pretty, pretty good that about this mod in a nutshell where the fact that you can, one, get um, a health checkup to see how well you're doing in your health region to expand your lifespan or shorten it. To a matter of fact, Don, leave me alone. Um... But yeah, overall, I think this mod is definitely a game changer and I'll be definitely using it for the time being whenever it gets updated to like, you know, health insurance, employee benefits, which I'm looking forward to. And what is this? Ooh, oh, she has the um, gold digger aspiration. Forgot about that. Um, so he has a good workout. So I'm guessing maybe we can go now to another private practice health checkup. We can. Okay, so since we already have that already in check and we just got our increased our lowered our body fat, I'm gonna go and do another health checkup to see what we can really do here and see if it, if it has worked. Because I guess what the doctor said, is she okay? Oh my lord, that was scary. Um, but I, I guess the fact that we were working on the treadmill for like about a couple hours, we were able to one lower our body fat but also improve our health. And so the, hopefully the doctor says that, oh, since your recent um, adventure to the treadmill, we have you have improved your health for the time, for the for the better. Oh, D Dustin, Dustin, come on, 
We're gonna can we potty train your brother? We cannot. Oh, okay, okay, good. So we have a new health report. Lovely. Great. So, so now that we're back with our health report, it now says that we're underweight and we have high blood pressure. So it says now Brandy might find wait wait, Brandy might find they get tired a little faster and then if they have a healthy body body weight, they are also an increased risk of health issues if they result into a lower lifespan. Oh no. So now we have to do um, a workout machine or a punch bag to increase our, uh, our muscle or eat to build our body fat and our high blood pressure. Same exact thing, a lower lifespan. <laughs> Not a great time for a Brandy Broke. Am I right, kids, or am I right? So Brandy, you need to eat some food. So let's go ahead and actually eat some, uh, I guess we can probably eat some food real quick have some dinner of some high protein plate that should probably help with her her body fat to increase a little bit better for the doctor but yeah you guys i think this mod is one of uh one of the mods that i really do like and i was been looking forward to because i remember like i think last year probably when they first announced it like for like a announced that they were making the mod i was kind of happy that they were because i was looking forward to it and now it's a thing we're gonna eat this real quick but the fact that it's a thing now and it's working, it's the thing that I've been waiting for. And I'm happy that we have it. So we have eaten our food. Good. And I'm guessing we can probably not work on the treadmill anymore. I think we'll be fine. Okay. So I, I'm guessing that she's already done with, this, with everything right now. So I'm going to clean this up real quick. And she has high blood pressure because she's very, very tired. Low bladder. So let's use the bathroom. And then we can take a nice little bath. And that should increase our, well, lower our chance of high blood pressure. So I think we should be good with everything. What is this? Need to be spoiled? I don't think so. I, I feel like the reason why she has high blood pressure because she's not getting any sleep because of Dustin being a, a teen angst rebel kid and Bo being all emotionally crazy and Theo being a newborn baby is becoming a, a bit of a hassle for her. And so Dustin has to step up a little bit to take care of the children a lot more often. It's been a, it's been rough. As you can tell, it's been rough for Brandy and Brandy is not having it today because one, she has no husband. Two, she has three kids. And three, she's just having a bit of a trouble of sleeping, which I can kind of see there. But overall, this is pretty much the whole mod in a nutshell. And I'm glad that you guys stuck around this far. If you have, let me know down in the comments below what time is it for you and what point in the video you um, are at right now. Or, you, or you're at this point in time. Either way. But yeah. <laughs> I'm a mess. This mod is fun and I really, really do love it. But overall, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys all in the very next video. Oh, yeah. That's it. Feed your, feed your brother. Feed your brother the yo. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys all in the very next video. Bye.